Hi there, is how it is going in these days? I stay at home and I go out only because of my job and go to supermarket. And I just figured out that it would be interesting if I will tell you what Russian like to buy in supermarket. It is not about some popular product uh, with the tourists like vodka, caviar and blini because everybody know that Russian like to buy it. This video will be about some products you probably don't know. These products are authentic, are favorite by Russian and are made in Russia. And one more thing is they are really cheap. All of those cost no more one or two dollars. I can charge you if you will like this food, but definitely Russian like it. And definitely, at least, you should try it. The first one, processed cheese friendship. This cheese came from Soviet time. It is a small size bricks. This cheese has a tight shape and a simple taste without adding flavor. There are also different modern similar brands of cheese. But I love this one because this cheese remember me, my childhood. Such foil packaging as from Soviet past, plus it is the cheapest. It is considered not healthy food, but maybe one sometimes uh, you should try it. And I'm really interested how you would call this product in English, because I'm not sure that processed cheese is uh, correct. The next product uh, vegans will appreciate. It is a squash caviar or marrow caviar. I actually don't understand uh, what is different between squash and uh, marrow. And I just put a picture. And I so liked it uh, in my childhood. So this caviar is squash puree with tomato paste. And you can make a sandwiches with the bread and uh, this squash uh, caviar. Quite hearty and suitable for vegans meal. Seaweed salad is also popular by Russian. It is a seaweed kale from the region of Russia, from the uh, far east. It can be simple, just kale with uh, just a salt without spicy and also it can be with spicy. The kale is packed in canned jars, also popular in Soviet time in my childhood and usually adults said that you need to eat it because it's a really healthy food. We believed it and actually for me it is quite tasty. The next will be the group of canned uh, fish food. As you noticed, uh, previous uh, product uh, which I called also packed in canned jars. It is because this food came uh, from Soviet time. It was a really popular way of packaging food. So about fish food. Spreads uh, in tomato sauce, spreads in oil and cutfish liver. This food was popular in Soviet time and uh, remain popular in these days. Really cheap and Russian like to eat it uh, as a separately or with a side dish. And also it's popular snacks for vodka. Sunflower seeds. So authentic and favorite Russian snack. Sunflower seeds are usually eaten uh, fried. It contains something that doesn't allow you to break away from it. And also there is some saying when you uh, eat something a similar shape, like a bunch, a little tiny food, and you like it, you can stop it. And uh, in this situation you can say that this food like sunflower seeds. And one interesting stereotype, and partly it is a true, what kind of uh, Russian like to eat sunflower seed uh, outdoors? It is a Russian babushkas and gopniks. Do you know about gopniks? If you don't, uh, please text me in comment and I will make a separate video. It's worth it. Go to drinks and uh, sorry, but uh, not about alcohol in this video. Bird juice. Do you know, guys, about this drink? It is a seasonable product. It is uh, not easy to find it in uh, winter. I, I actually think that it's impossible. It is harvested in the springtime and so it is sold in springtime. Bird juice uh, has a light, sweet and really pleasant taste. Ryazhenka. It is a sour milk drink. As I know, there is no analog in different country uh, and that is why you should try it. Russian drink Ryazhenka in daily life. It is made from baked milk by lactic acid fermentation. <sighs> 
It is really tasty and has a soft and delicate taste. Refreshing and nourishing drink. About Russian dessert, a plum bear. It is an ice cream with high amount of milk fat. Of course, it is not traditional Russian dessert, as I know it uh, came from France, uh, but uh, Russian plumbeer has uh, one feature. Uh, this ice cream in special simple waffle cup. It has so simple taste and uh, it is so cheap. It is a good way to buy it for refreshing when you go on the street in uh, hot summer time condensed milk, in Russian сгущенка. It is a cover milk from which water has been removed with added sugar. It is a really thick and sweet food. It looks like syrup and also it can be stored for a long time. Classic combination of Russian pancakes, blini uh, with condensed milk or сырники with condensed milk or uh, aladi. Tulski pryanik or tulas pryanik. Traditionally pryaniki are made from flour and honey. This cookie are analog gingerbread, but a Russian pryanik doesn't contain ginger. Pryaniki are covered with the sugar icing. Russian pryanik has a round shape and tulas pryanik has rectangle shape. As you can guess, Tulski Pryanik is called like that because are made in the Russian city Tula. And the last one is chocolate Alenka, iconic Russian chocolate with a picture of a girl in a scarf on a packaging. This chocolate has a creamy, greasy taste. It is produced in Russia since 60s. The name chocolate got after the daughter of Valentina Tereshkova, the woman cosmonaut. His daughter has a name Yelena. In Russian culture, Yelena and Alena, it is like similar names. So what do you think about this type of food? Is there some similar in your country? I hope that the border was open soon and you will have possibility to come to Russia and try it. So thank you for watching. Bye-bye.